Hi, hello, welcome to Joji classes. Uh, how is class 12? You're doing good, right? Okay, fine. Now, you are going to do one more problem from issue of shapes. Okay, let's solve the problem from issue of shapes. Last classes, uh, we are done with the formats, we are done with the premium, discount and egg part. If the issue, how to calculate. Okay, so now in this video, for feature we are learning. I think in the old video also, you learn one question on when they issued egg part and there were some calls in arrears. So, how do they forfeit it? Okay, now in this question, if they issued at premium and again four feature is there, then how do you deal with them? Okay, so that is the question and the discount also we will finish it off today itself. Okay, so in this question, I am not going to solve once again the whole thing. Okay, I will start up from direct four feature. Call scenarios and four feature I will start up because those journals will be remain same. If you want, you can check in the description the old uh, video link I have shared here. Okay, you can just check that one. The same kind of journals only will be coming. Amount will change other than that nothing. Okay, so now first let us see for how much they have issued. What is the premium amount? Okay, so now here actual price is 100. They issued for 25 plus 55, 80 plus 30. That means 110 rupees they have issued. So how much is the premium? 10 rupees is the premium. Okay, so you have down 25 plus 55 plus 30. It is 110. What is the actual value is 100. Now what is the premium? It is 10 rupees. Clear? It is 10 rupees. Now, first, let me write on the journal for call scenarios. So for the call scenario, what is the journal you will be writing? Equity share, cap, uh, equity share, first and final call account data to equity share capital account. First and final call amount due. How many shares? 10,000 into 30 rupees. It will be 3 lakhs. Okay. Now, for receiving the money, you are writing the journal. Okay. The journal will be bank account. Data. If you want to show call scenarios, yes, please you can show the call scenarios or without call scenarios also you can write on the journal. Why I am showing call scenarios is it will be easy for you to do the for feature. Okay. So now I am writing call scenarios account. Data. To equity share. First and Final call account. Okay. So now what is the amount? First and final call amount is 30. How many shares they have not made the payment? 1000 shares they have not made the payment. What is the actual value of them? Total is 100. Total how many shares? 10,000 shares. Out of 10,000 shares, 1000 shares were not made the payment. That means how many shares were made the payment? 9,000 shares were paid. Total 10,000 shares were there. In that 1,000 was not made the payment. How many of them have paid? 9,000 shares were paid. Now 9,000 shares were paid. What is the amount? 30 rupees. <clears throat> then how much you will get? 2,70,000 we have received. How much we have not received? What is the call in arrears? 1000 shares. What is the price? 30 rupees. So write down 1000 into 30. How much you will get? 30,000. Then the total you will get 3 lakhs. So the narration by being first and final call amount received being first and final call amount received except Except 1000 shares. Being first and final call amount received, except 1000 shares. That is the narration. Now, let's move on to the four feature. That is the main part, right? Let it be premium or discount. You will be taking the share capital, the value of the share, whatever is the actual value. That only let them issue at par or premium 
or discount. Okay, when we are doing the four feature part, the share value will be considered as a part. Okay, now let's write on the journal for four feature. Equity share capital account data to four feature to four feature shares account. What is the amount they have not made the payment? Only first and final call. Other than that, everything they made the payment. Right? Only first and final call amount they have not paid. So, to equity share, first and final call account. Okay? Total how many shares? 1000 shares. What is the value? 100. So, what is the total amount? 1 lakh. Right? Now how much they have paid? How much they have not paid? Let us check it out. They didn't pay only first and final call. So 1000 into 30. How much you will get? 30,000. What they have paid? 55 plus 25. 80 rupees they have paid. Then how much you will get? Total 110 rupees you will get. But you have to take the actual value. Only actual value, premium and all we will not take here. Okay. So then how much we have paid? 1000 into 70. Okay. Now you will get 70,000. 70,000 and 30,000. Then being, being shares forfeited, being shares forfeited for non payment for non payment of first and final call for non payment of first and final call okay now next journal we are writing for reissue next journal we are writing for reissue when you are doing reissue are they paying separately? No. Reissued at 80 rupees. At a time you are receiving the amount. Okay. Then write down. How much we are receiving? 80 rupees only. So we got again less amount. Bank account data. Forfeited shares account data. Forfeited shares account data. 2. Equity share capital account. Equity share capital account. Total how many shares? 1000 shares. Actual value? 100. So it should be 1 lakh. They have reissued for 80 rupees. So we are receiving 80 rupees. Right? So 1000 into 80. Then how much you will? Sorry. 80 or 70? 80 we are receiving. Then it is 80,000. How much is loss here? According to this, that's all. Generally, we got profit only. But according to that, 100 rupees item you have issued for 80 rupees. That means it can be treated a kind of loss. So, it is 20. That is how much we are not receiving. 20 rupees we are not receiving. Okay. 1000 into 20, it is 20,000. Being reissued forfeited shares. Being reissued for fitted shares. Now the extra amount should be transferred to the reserve. Now the extra amount to be transferred to the reserve. So how do we transfer to the reserve? First, let us see whether you got profit or loss. So, so there are two methods to do. Here whatever is the for feature amount and here what is the for feature amount. Subtract both of them. Then whatever is the amount that we will be transferring to the reserve. Right? That is the easiest method. But I mentioned already... 1000 shares were forfeited but only 500 shares were reissued. That time how will you find out what is the uh, balance you got, how much you are going to transfer to the reserve. So let us know in both the ways what is the answer, how to calculate that one. Okay. So now first let me write on the journal. Uh, according to me it will be balance only. Right? Not loss. Forfeited. Shares account data to 
general reserve account this is the general okay being balance transfer to reserve b balance transfer to reserve how to find out the balance let us check it out okay what is the total amount we have received here i have mentioned total received amount is 70 right total received amount is 70 before forfeiture okay and in the ratio how much you have received 80 rupees so total how much you have received 150 what is the actual value of the share 100 right check here actual value of the share is 100 now you got profit or loss 100 rupees is the actual value but you have received 150 rupees so 50 rupees will be the balance for each share so 50 into 1000 you will be getting 50,000 Okay, 50 into total 1000 shares, you got 50,000 as balance. Okay, easy method. This four feature, how much you have? 70,000 minus this four feature, how much you have? 20,000. Then total 50,000 is transferred to reserve. So this is how we treat four feature if shares were issued at premium. Okay, so allotment, how to do, how to treat the premium. So everything was shown in the old question, uh, old video. You can check it out. It is there in the description. Okay, so the next one we have to solve problem on. Discount, when they issued at the discount. Okay, if for feature is there, how to treat and uh, what is the pending things. See, uh, generally we issue total 10,000 shares. Okay. Application till now we are receiving for 10,000 only. If, if you receive 12,000 applications, that time what to do? The extra 2,000, that kind of questions we have not, right? Uh, we have not discussed it, right? That is called as oversubscription. Okay. If you got less applications only 8000 only you got that time how to do okay so here we will be discussing and dealing everything between application and, and allotment only so only those three four journals we will be discussing in one more video okay these are the topics were pending yes we will finish them very very fast okay after that you will be having quiz also come on check the quiz and find out the answers and then you let me know in the comment section that motivate us to make more videos. Okay. Hope these videos are beneficial to you, right? Okay, fine. Please like it, share it and subscribe it. Thank you. Bye-bye.